This morning in Northeast Harris County, there are a whole lot of questions after human remains were found at a fire damaged home less than 24 hours ago. The disturbing discovery made by the new homeowners our Michelle Troy joins us live and Michelle investigators are now looking for the former homeowner and tenant, right? Yeah, that's right, Trace. And, you know, investigators are hoping they'll be able to shed some more light as to who those human remains belong to and how it ended up in that house. Take a look. This was the scene from last night, that home located on Villa Grove Drive. Now, according to the Harris County Sheriff's Office, the house had caught fire back in August. It was part of an arson investigation. At some point, the house got sold and the new owners were in the process of cleaning up the debris for the past two days to remodel it when they discovered rib bones and a skull near the entrance way to the house. Now detectives say it is a full skeleton and the remains appear to have been there when the fire initially happened. After talking with neighbors, detectives learned prior to being sold, the home was a rental and that the tenant was about to be evicted. Nobody has seen that person since August. They were seen leaving the house about two hours before the fire started. So we don't know uh, where those remains came from in the house. If it may have been, you know, part of the tenant returned to the house, nobody saw him when he returned, or if it may have been somebody else living in the house. Yeah, at this time, detectives say that former tenant has not been named as a suspect. As for the cause of the fire, well, that is still unknown. Detectives tell us that the medical examiner's uh, anthropology department collected those human remains and they will now work to determine the person's identity and cause of death. Trayson. So many questions. We know that you'll stay on top of it, Michelle. Thank you.